Hello friends, I'm going to show you how I did this graphic. So let's begin. Let's create a square document. The first thing is to add guides and turn on snapping. We create a square with round corners and the fill is going to be 60% gray. Now we're going to add a circle and we're going to fill it with white. And we're going to add a blur effect. We need to set these layers blending mode to overlay. Now we're going to add a second circle and we're going to make it black. I'm making this layer a bit transparent so we can see what we're doing because uh, we're going to make this uh, circular ring and make it look like this, touching only the corners of the square. Set the transparency back to 100% and also we need to select scale with objects in the layers effects panel and also for the white circle. Select both layers and drop them on top of the square layer. Now we select the option Canvas and then Clip to Canvas. Scale up the square so it is larger than the canvas, like this. Now we are ready to power duplicate. So duplicate the square, rotate it 18 degrees and scale it down like this. Now all we need to do is select Duplicate several times. Select canvas and clip to canvas once again. Let's select all of the layers and group them together. We're also going to duplicate that group. In our first group, we're going to select every other layer so we can add some color. Now we go to the group on top and we are going to delete every circle in that group. So we select uh, all the squares, open them and select the circles and delete them one by one. After we are done, we close the group, select it, and then we are going to set the fill for that group to uh, none, and the stroke we are going to set it to white, and the stroke we are going to set it to uh, 3.4, 3.5, the thickness for the line. We are going to rotate that group a little bit and we're also going to scale it up a little bit.
finish this, I'm going to add a little bit of blur to this group. I'm not quite happy with the shadows part, so I'm going to select every black circle and I'm going to make it um, some dark pink instead of black. Yeah, I think it looks much better. Um, I hope you find this little tutorial helpful. Let me know what you think in the comments. And I'll see you soon. Have a great day.